What is the difference between merge and append in Power Query in Power BI? In this video, I'll explain when you would use merge and when append is more appropriate. But in short, with merge we add columns and with append we add rows. In Power Query, I have a table which contains employees' names and a separate table which tracks whether the employee works from home. I would like to join these two tables together and in this scenario, I use Merge. Why? Because I am looking to add more information to an existing record. I'm looking to see the employee name then they're working from home status. I am looking to read across the row. I have a common column between the two tables called employee ID. So in merge queries, I select employee ID from the employees table. Then I select the south region table and select the employer ID column, then click OK separate out my columns. I can then add the work from home column and click OK. As you can see, I have added more columns to the table and for the relevant record, you can read information across the row. So merge adds columns. For append, I am not looking to add more information to existing records. I am looking to add more rows, more records. For this example, I have a table called South Region and a table called North Region. I would like to create a query which contains all rows from the North Region and all rows from the South Region. Note that this time I need to have the same column header names for the columns to be in the same order and for them to be of the same type. I can then use append queries, select both regions, click OK. And as you can see, this time the number of rows has increased. In summary, Use merge if looking to add columns and append if you would like to add rows. Please give this video the thumbs up if you found it helpful and check out my other videos on this topic, links in the description below. And subscribe to the channel for more data tips. Thanks for watching.